I'm Sean Canning, Principal Architect of 1070 Architecture. This video series is intended to give you an inside look into the sketchbook of a practicing architect. Oftentimes, a client will ask me to design them an exterior living space. Commonly, these types of spaces are outdoor living rooms or outdoor kitchens. Basically, any space you have indoors, you could also move outdoors. A retractable glazing system is really an elegant way to handle the threshold between inside and the outside. These systems allow you to fold away or slide away large portions of the wall. So you're further blurring the lines and connecting the spaces. There are some important things to consider when choosing to program an exterior space. One of the most important details is how you make this transition from your interior to your exterior. And the concept of transitional space is really a high level architectural concept. Architecture is about experiences, the way you experience the space, the way you experience your home. And the way you enter and exit your home is an important component of that. Imagine you have two types of spaces in your home. You have your interior space, which is covered by a ceiling and a roof, and you have your exterior uncovered space, which is open to the sunlight, open to the elements. Now, what we want to do is ease the transition between the interior space and the covered exterior space. So a great way to do this is to install a trellis structure. And there's a couple major benefits to doing this. First off, we're establishing a covered exterior space, which becomes the transition between our interior and our exterior uncovered space. We're also shading any windows or doors here from direct sunlight. Particularly if we're on the south or western side, this becomes an important concern. On this particular project, there was a couple tricks we employed, which I'll mention. So as you retract this glazing, there is a large area of the living room, the indoor living room, which is connected to this transitional space. So we matched the grain of the hardwood floors on the inside with the grain and the direction of the new decking on the outside to blend this transition. The view you're seeing in this sketch was one of the main approaches of the home. So we gave it a very definitive focal point. The completed design of this exterior living space included some really cool edible landscaping, which we thought would be symbolic to carry on into the focal point. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, click on the link below and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you use social media, don't forget to like our Facebook page and follow me on Twitter at 1070architect.